hi and welcome to today's lesson, reciprocals. Here we have seven eighths and we are going to find its reciprocal. A number and its reciprocal have a product of one. So I'm gonna be multiplying seven eighths by something that will give me an answer of one. Whenever I'm using a reciprocal, I'm really just moving my numerator to the denominator's position and my denominator to the numerator's position. So 7 eighths becomes 8 sevenths. The reason this works is because remember, I want a product of one. So seven times eight is 56 and eight times seven is 56. And any number divided by itself is equal to one. So let's try a couple of different examples of this. Here we have a whole number two. And you might say, well, where is its denominator? Well, remember, a whole number has a denominator of one. So this two is really two over one. Now, my numerators and denominators will switch. So two will switch from my numerator to the denominator and one will switch from my denominator to the numerator. So the reciprocal of two is one half. What if I have a mixed number? Here, I have to convert my mixed numbers to improper fractions first. So five times six is 30, plus three is 33. So I have 33 fifths, and then my numerator and denominator will switch places. So I end up with five over 33, or five 30 thirds. So what is the reciprocal of six and three fifths? Five 30 thirds. Why don't you give it a try? Pause the video and try these three examples. Unpause when you're ready for the answers. Three sevenths, we're just going to switch places for my numerator and denominator. So the seven would move to the top and the three would move to the bottom. The reciprocal of three sevenths is seven thirds. The reciprocal of one eighteenth, my 18 would move to the top and my one would move to the bottom and my reciprocal of one 18 is 18 over 1, or just 18. For my mixed number, remember I have to turn this into an improper fraction first. So 4 times 4 is 16, and 16 plus 3 is 19. So 4 and 3 fourths is 19 fourths. And then to find the reciprocal, my numerator and my denominator will switch places. So I end up with 4 19 Let's wrap up. When finding the reciprocal, you'll convert any mixed number into improper fractions. Numerator becomes the denominator and the denominator becomes the numerator. That wraps up our lesson. Thanks so much for tuning in. Feel free to click to subscribe for this and other videos. Until next time.